Hey curl friends, I'm Bianca Renee, and you're watching Bianca Renee today. And today I'm getting to the end of my braids. This is the longest I've ever had my hair in a protective style because I probably have forced myself not to make curly hair videos due to postpartum life, but they have served me well. But I do miss my curls and I probably should wash my hair one of these years. So before I take them out, I got a little creative and I was like, what if I could change the color of them? before we really get rid of them. First I thought maybe doing like a red hair paint on my roots so that it's like all one color. But then I thought, what if we take it to the next level and try like blue? Let's try it. I've never put a hair color paint, wax, whatever, on my braids before. Let's just do it. I'm gonna be using the Avon hair color paint and turn my braids blue. Will it make it purple because it's already red? I don't know if mixing is like a thing when you're just putting it on top of a color. I'm not really mixing colors, but I don't know. This is going to be an experimental video. This might not work. <laughs> this might be a what I thought I was going to do video, but um, let's just get into it. So I'm going to put on some gloves. I've used this color before when I did purple and I was like popping purple, potent purple. Make sure you guys watch that video. I didn't have a problem washing it off, but I'm still gonna wear gloves just because. Oh, okay, let's take it out the ponytail. <gasps> Wait, goodbye, Red. Okay, where do we begin? Should we just do like a practice break? Cause this might not work at all. I've seen it done on dreads before, so I feel like it should work. I mean, it's hair, right? Okay, so I'm gonna get a little scoop to dupe. Oh, forgot about the consistency. Here we go. Oh, oh, okay, hold on, let's, let's get a little more generous. Hmm. Oh, wow. I hope you can still see the indentation of the braids. Hmm. I don't know how this is gonna work. I feel like the red's gonna be a little bit harder to cover. Maybe? How long is this gonna dry? That's the real question. Okay, let's just, you know me, I'm not one for sections. I just kind of go ham. Let's grab a nice little chunk and just like rub it all on there. Yeah, there we go. Ain't nobody got time. I'm a mother of two. Over here acting like I have spare time. Anybody got time to spare anymore? Fun! Let's get to the root of the thing. Wow. <laughs> I was wondering how this is gonna be because it's really made for like, you know, it does best on curls. Wow, the forehead's blue. We're getting real avatar real quick. This might look horrible. <laughs> Let's just keep going. Wow, I am an avatar. I'm getting really excited for Halloween. I'm gonna be doing a whole bunch of different colors in my hair per usual. Give me some costume um, ideas. Oh, okay, it's working. I see the vision now. Do you see the vision? I see the vision. I don't know why I haven't seen more people do this. I know I'm not the first, but I really haven't seen it done. Let's see if I could do all this hair with one jar. Oh, look at the arms. <laughs> I'm blue, da ba dee da ba day. Let me get a towel, cause my chair is yellow. Not the face. The transfer is more potent on these braids than it is my curls, I think. But it all washes off. Have no fear. Maybe just don't wear your favorite shirt while you do this. Or like a white shirt. Or the shirt you're gonna wear after this dries. Hair could be so fun. You just gotta try new things. Like, I kind of like the ombre into the to the burgundy. It's kind of giving like purple mermaid vibes. I'm gonna pretend like I did this on purpose. Let's do full blue up top and kind of leave some of the red at the bottom. This is so fun. Okay, so I love it. I think this would be a great 
thing to try on Halloween if you have a protective style but you still want to be like in theme with whatever character you're trying to be and change the color of your hair instead of wearing a wig because you can't wear a wig when you have braids. Solution. But I'm going to let it dry because right now it is kind of messy and like getting on everything. So let's see how long it really takes to like dry and not transfer. Hopefully it won't transfer and it'll just like stick to the braids. We'll see. I'll be back. Okay, so it's been about 40 minutes. Let's see. It is drying. Not as bad. But I do think I'm gonna hit it with a blow dryer real quick. Okay, so I'm going to wash off the blue and come right back. Ready for the reveal? Dun, 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 dun. gonna like it that's why I knew I should have done this sooner so I could wear it blue longer and not just wash it out <sighs> the downside of having a curly hair channel my protective styles are so short <laughs> I really like the the two-toned isn't it cute I used basically the whole thing so if I wanted to be like blue blue and do my entire length it might not have been enough I did put a lot of layers of blue on top. Do a little scrunch. Ta-da! No transfer. We're good. Good, because I wasn't sure if that was going to work. Correction, the next day my shirt was definitely blue. I don't think it can penetrate into synthetic hair the way it does real hair because when I did it on my curls, it was totally fine, no transfer. But if you're gonna wear it on your braids, just make sure it's completely dry before you wear it out. I'll definitely be doing it again, but probably just for the day. So there you have it. That is how I turned my braids blue with ease. I didn't have to buy new hair. I didn't have to get my hair rebraided. I highly suggest playing around with the color of your braids because it's so fun, especially on Halloween, like get creative. So if you wanna get the Avon hair paint for yourself, they have a bunch of fun colors. I've done purple and blue thus far. Both work great. They're very potent in the color. That's probably my favorite thing about her colors is that they are bright and vibrant. So there's that. You're also supporting a small, new, black-owned, woman-owned brand. So I will make sure to link her website in the description box. She also gave me a promo code. So if you guys want a discount, make sure you use it to save some money. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I post new videos every week. You also can follow me on Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter at Ms. Bianca Renee. And I think it's safe to say that I'm back from my maternity leave. I can't stay away much longer. There's new curly hair products out that I haven't tried yet, so I gotta get back to work. I'm anxious, and I do kind of miss my curls. Even though this blue is kind of fire, though. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching Bianca Renee today.